Are you, uh, Terrell Fuchs? Yes. Hi. I'm, uh, I'm Hugh Gwaden. I'm in, well, I, I was thinking of doing law, eventually. Uh, Jolie Scoba told me sometimes you do research. For papers? For money. Yeah, yeah, that's right, so how much? Well, it depends on the subject, the length. About a thousand words anti-hate law literature in Ontario? Two hundred, including layout. For two fifty, I'll write the thing. Do I look like I have that kind of money? Yes. I'll need it for next week. No problem. You can pick it up at my place. Papers over there. Right. Right. Wow. This is great. I mean, you're obviously really good at this. Did you ever think of studying law yourself? I was a lawyer. Was? I got disbarred. They disbarred me. It's a long story. I guess it would be. Well, listen, I have another assignment coming up, and I was hoping that you... Right, right, I didn't pay you for this one yet, did I? When's it due? Tuesday. On? Tuesday. I'm, I mean on uh, probate challenges. 2,000 words, any topic. Um, I could, you could bring it by my place this time, if you like. Here's my card. The address is there. Fine. I'll see you then. Terrell, you're uh, American, right? Right. Thought so. Listen, do you want something to drink? I've got Coke, Sprite, Evian. No. I already ate. Was there another assignment? Uh, no. No, not yet. Oh, well, thanks for reminding me, though. Say, Terrell, I, I wanted to ask you, back in your apartment, was that, uh, was that yoga you were doing? Yeah. H have you been into that long? Since about my second year in jail. You were in jail? Four years. I, I, I didn't know they taught yoga in jail. Yeah, well, they teach you all kinds of things. Oh. You need anything else? You let me know. Terrell, do you mind if I ask you why you got disbarred? I made a wrong turn in the wrong lane. Front ended a woman's car. Her baby went through the windshield. Jesus Christ, they sent you to jail? 
Yes, I was drunk. Excuse me. Wolf? What? Oh, yeah, that. <clears throat> okay. Why do you have the misspelled word wolf tattooed across your back? It's not a word. It's a name. As far as I know, he spelled it like that on purpose. So, why exactly did you let some guy tattoo his name on your back? I didn't let him. He just did it. He didn't have a choice. He was my owner. What? My owner. He bought me for ten packs of cigarettes at this thing called a fish auction. Where all the lifers get to bid on them. The new prisoners they want to fuck. You're kidding. Say thanks. That was Wolf's big line. I don't think I need to elaborate. That's horrible. But why... why did he want to... Wolf wasn't the brightest penny in the jar. If he didn't write his name on everything he owned, he'd probably forget who it belonged to. Do you ever think about getting it removed? I don't make enough money helping people like you out to cover that kind of expenditure, you. But it's on your body now, for life. I mean, it must be like, every time you look at it, you must feel like he still owns you. My body doesn't belong to anybody. Not even me. It's a flesh envelope. Use once, then return to sender. Anyway, Wolf never got anything of me that mattered. He knew it too. One of my little victories. Was there another assignment? No, not yet. I really gotta be somewhere, you. Hey, uh, I got an A on that first paper. Yeah, I'm happy for you. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> You mean physically? He did head the local chapter of the Ghost Riders. The what? The Ghost Riders, uh, a biker gang. Weed selling, hog riding, far right white trash with Nazi pretensions. I have to go now, Hugh. Wait, wait just a minute, I'll be right out. Hugh, I have to go. Well, Jesus, don't you answer your phone anymore? I got another assignment, last minute. Yeah, well, uh, about that, I won't be able to help you with your papers. I'm leaving town. You leave? When? Right now. Why? Are, are you in trouble with the cops? You had to break parole to come up here, right? Can I ever just tell you something, you? Or do you always have to know just a little bit more? Well, I guess I thought we were kind of 
friends or something. It's the Ghost Riders. They've been following me. And I don't know a single other thing about it except uh, that they uh, follow me from city to city. And they have orders to find me and torture me and kill me. After Wolf died. Whoa, Wolf died? Yes, Hugh. Someone stuck a shank in his back and it punctured a lung. And he choked to death on his own blood. And then the warden put me in isolation for my own protection. But since isolation is for snitches, it became the general opinion that I either knew something I was going to trade for an early release or had something to do with Wolf's death. Did you? I didn't care enough about Wolf to waste my time trying to get him killed. Well, did you tell them that? No. <laughs> Why should I? That's the worst they can do. Torture and kill you? So what? <laughs> no matter how long they make it take, they can only do it once. Just like anybody else. Wait, though. Is all this friendliness just the result of some sort of vague liberal guilt over me helping you cheat, or are you actually feeling sorry for me? You think because I was victimized, I'm a victim? Be serious. I'm the strongest person I know. I know. I know that. I do feel like I made you stick around. Well, you did. And they caught up with me. And now I'll deal with it. Alone. <laughs> what do you want from me, Hugh? To help, somehow. To understand. Oh, isn't that nice? You look at me, and maybe you see the ruin of some of your own formative characteristics. And you think, hey, there but for the grace of whoever. But at the end of the day, I'm still me, and you're still you. And you're still incapable of understanding the distinction. You want to be me, you? Hmm? You think because we look a little alike on paper, you could ever hope to rise to any of the occasions that I've had to rise to? Can't even write your own essays. All right. Okay, I'm useless, okay? I understand that. Compared to you, everyone's a dilettante. Just let me help. Just a little. Let me do something for you. In exchange for what, huh? You want me to bend over so you can sign your name on my back? Huh? Next to, next to Wolf's? No, thanks. I've been made to say thanks enough times to last me the rest of my life. I don't want you to... I don't want you to say thanks. I just want to... I don't even fucking know what I want. Fine. You want to do something for me? No strings attached? Out of the pure goodness of your heart? Give me your coat. Okay. Just mean I can have yours? Feel free. Alike. Does it make you feel better? As a matter of fact, yes. Well, I suppose you should say thanks. Thank you very much, Teresa.
Oh no. Thank you. Here's the cause of it all. Ignore the world.